Hello, dear travelers, and welcome to beautiful Barbuda, a hidden gem in the Caribbean. Our adventure begins in the capital of Antigua and Barbuda, St. John's. From there, we'll hop on a short flight to Barbuda, where pristine beaches and rich history await. As we step foot on Barbuda's soil, let me tell you a bit about its fascinating past. The island was originally inhabited by the Arawak and Carib peoples, but it was claimed by the British in the 17th century. Today, Barbuda remains an overseas territory of the United Kingdom, maintaining its unique culture and charm. Our first stop is the Codrington House, a grand mansion built in the 18th century by the Codrington family, who were major landowners on the island. The house now serves as a museum, showcasing the island's history and the life of its inhabitants. As we wander through the beautifully restored rooms, keep an eye out for the friendly ghosts. The legend has it that Sir Christopher Codrington himself roams these halls. Next up, we'll visit the Frigate Bird Sanctuary, home to one of the largest colonies of frigate birds in the world. These majestic creatures, with their striking red throat pouches, put on a mesmerizing display during mating season. Make sure to bring your cameras, folks, and let's capture some bird romance. After an exciting day of exploration, we'll head to the Pink Sand Beach. Yes, you heard that right, Pink Sand. This stunning stretch of coastline gets its rosy hue from tiny red shells, making it a one-of-a-kind sight you won't find anywhere else. Take a dip in the crystal-clear waters, bask in the Caribbean sun, and let your worries wash away. Now, it's time to satisfy our taste buds with some local delicacies. We'll head to a traditional restaurant to indulge in some mouth-watering Antiguan and Barbudan cuisine. Don't forget to try the Fungi, a savory cornmeal dish, and the famous pepper pot stew. But be warned, the pepper pot can be quite spicy, so keep your cool, folks. Once our bellies are full, we'll make our way to the Martello Tower, a historic fortification built in the early 19th century to defend against potential invaders. The tower's strategic location offers breathtaking views of the island and its surroundings, providing the perfect backdrop for some group selfies. Finally, as the sun sets over the horizon, we'll gather at a local beach bar to enjoy some lively Caribbean music and dance the night away. Get ready to show off your best dance moves, as the locals are more than happy to teach you some island grooves. I hope you enjoyed this memorable tour through Barbuda, filled with history, natural wonders, and of course, a good dose of laughter. As you head back to St. John's, take a piece of Barbuda with you in your heart and cherish the memories of this enchanting island. Until we meet again, farewell and safe travels.